We build this awesome grill so you can do it better. And the best part, we didn't use any welding. Hello, hello everyone, hope you all doing great and without further ado, let's get straight into this build. We took a piece of sheet metal, did the measurements and then we cut it to the right dimensions. I will not repeat all the dimensions as you can build it however you like, but if you need them I will post a link in the description to a free set of plans. Be sure to sand all the edges to avoid any cuts and also we advise you to wear gloves and protection glasses, even though we sometimes forget our own advice. We've then cut all the corners so we can later fold it into a box. To fold it into a box we only use the piece of angle iron, a heavy and straight piece of metal, some clamps, our hands and a lot, and I mean a lot of hammering. We cut the pieces for the small legs If you wonder why this many, it's because we built 3 grills But you need just 4 of them for one build We've mounted them on the box but not before we marked and drilled some pilot holes. We fix them with one screw from beneath for easy fix, then later remove it and screw it back from the inside as we did with the others.
We've marked the place for the screws, then fix together the corners using a small piece of squared pipe, which will be used also to support the top grill. We've fixed the stopper to our desired length, then cut all the bar pieces we needed for the top grill. After we've sanded the tips of the bars, we've cut the squared pipe needed for the top frame. We marked 29 spots on the pipe, then drilled the holes for the bars. As you can see, we use this old drill press. We plan a restoration video for it, so stay tuned. To fix the corners of the top grill, we used some triangle pieces of metal sheet. We've inserted the bars in the holes and we thought we are done, but after a fire test we realized that we need to straighten the box. For this we build this frame and screw it on the bottom of the box. This is it everyone, a nice and not too difficult build with an awesome result. Thanks for watching and hope to see your thoughts in the comment section.